yo, people, what is going on? This is like a Spartan Killer, and welcome to science! Okay, so, I'm sure that some of you guys know what these are. Um, these right here. These are wonderful things called Freeze Pops, Freezies, Otter Pops, um, I don't know what you, what else you want to call them, the Freeze Popsicles, Frozen Ice Treats. Um, okay, so I'm sure that some of you guys have seen videos on YouTube of this, um, about super cooling. Now, in here, in my hand, god, look at this freezer. Okay, so there is one in here that is still in liquid form, and this is what's known as super cool. Now, I'm not going to get into the whole technical, science -y specifics behind it, but this one behind it is frozen solid. I need to try not to disturb this one, because once you disturb this one, uh, it's going to start freezing and turn it into slush. Now you can do this with any, I'm going to get out of the fan of the freezer. You can do this with any liquid, any beverage, anything. Oh, giraffe! You can do this with anything like soda, um, whatever you have in there, juice, Kool-Aid, I don't care, whatever. But all it is, is that the liquid remains undisturbed, and then the draw, the freezing point of it is dropped, or yada yada yada, it gets so cold that the molecules in it stop moving, and so once you hit it, it's going to refreeze it. So, we're going to see it in action. I'm going to pick it up slowly. Pick it up slowly. You can see the ice at the top of it. You can see how it's see-through. It's not frozen yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch this to where you can get up close and personal with it. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to hit it. There we go. Once you see it start freezing, it's going to start, it's going to create a chain reaction inside, and then it's all just going to start solidifying. You can see it slowly growing, slowly growing to the end. How cool is that? You can do this with anything to make like an instant slushy. You can see how the top is completely filled up now, and then the only thing that's left is this little bit right here. Oh, that's started to go, oh beautiful and then now all it is is a solid slushy material now it's going to be a little bit liquid because the heat from my hand is starting to warm it up but that's pretty much what you can do with any liquid in the uh in the freezer as long as you don't touch it um there's a bajillion tutorials on youtube on how to do it i see it all the time when i try to get a freeze pop i'm like addicted to freeze pops freezies otter pops whatever you want to call them i think they're stinking amazing so um, try it because it's actually pretty cool if you watch it just like slowly spread. It's cool. You just need to agitate it enough to where it starts a train reaction. Chain reaction. Did I say train re I didn't say train, but I'm going to clarify. Chain reaction. And it's actually pretty cool watching it slowly freeze over. Uh, you can do it with water. You can do it with anything. Just Google it. Search it up on YouTube. Uh, super cold water. And it'll tell you how to do it exactly. I think it's like you leave it in there for like five minutes or something like that. I don't know. I'm not sure. Don't take my word for it. Go check it out. Uh, but as of right now, it looks like our time is up. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Leave a comment down below whatever you are thinking. And I will see you guys next time. Peace! Oh, look. I have another one. You see it slowly starting to meet in the middle. The more violent the, the moving of the liquid, the faster it's going to go. It's so cool. Slowly at the bottom. Slowly meeting together for the first time. Best friends since the second grade. A loving embrace.